Now, if you visited the coastal town of Abareiron recently, you may have noticed a lot of work taking place on the harbour front. The town's tidal defences are being strengthened with a £30 million cash injection. But as Lewis Rees-Jones explains, it's proved a real talking point locally. On a sunny day like this, Abereiron is a tranquil haven. But in stormier conditions, it's quite a different story. Flooding like this has become an increasingly common sight along the harbour. And a project is underway to strengthen the town's defences against rising sea levels and climate change. The coastal defence scheme includes the construction of a breakwater and flood walls, with boulders brought over from Norway as part of the work. The walls that they had before the project provided protection of a wave over topping of a one-in-one one flood and it only provides a one in 50 protection against the, the, the sea level rises. This scheme will actually allow protection for up to 100 years based on anticipated sea level rises. There's over 168 properties that will be protected by these new works. The scheme costs around £32 million. 85% of that funding is coming from the Welsh Government, with Ceredigion Council contributing the rest. There have been concerns expressed by residents, local councillors and the local council in terms of the impact that flooding has on houses, the economy and individuals themselves. As you can see now, the, the amount of work that's going on but the positive impact that that will have for the residents and the businesses within the, the community of Abreron will be you know, endless in terms of making their properties safe. Along with the fact that in terms of the disruption that's currently going on, but it is a short-term pain for a very, very long-term gain. Abereiron Harbour is an iconic setting enjoyed by both locals and holidaymakers who come to Ceredigion. But after a year of intensive work along the front, it's expected the project will come to a conclusion in the first half of 2025. Negatively, it's a scheme nobody wanted to happen in Abereiron because we, during our peak periods from Easter through to the end of September. Uh, positively, it's something that has to be done and you just have to work through it and cross fingers that we can all survive uh, a hard winter, which is always hard. But this year in particular, our summer months have been hit by the work. We just want to see Aberaeron back to its best, ready to go for a, a bumper season and then hopefully we can put the, the woes of the weather and the hard work behind us and look to the future. Once the project is finished, Abereiron should be better protected by what nature might throw its way. Now the local authority is looking at other coastal areas that could benefit from similar schemes in future. Lewis Rees-Jones, ITV News.